Bro, that should be yeah, that's a push. Oh my god, bro. Do not fret. Oh my god. Oh my god! Uh, I'm in the chat! I'm in the chat! It is so fucking Why the f is this guy not dead yet? This is the best Batman Ice Shunko build in type soul. You're gonna need Susan Bachis as your Sheik guy, okay? And obviously, you're gonna need Ice Shunko. Ice Shunko is very nasty, y'all. You're gonna see in this video, I give you tips on how to use it properly with the Susan Bachi Sheik guy. If you don't know how to get Shunko, just watch a video on how to get it. Vanquished has like a one minute video. It's pretty simple. All you have to do is get two frags and then talk to the Division 6 captain, do his quest, and you get advanced Shunko. If you're wondering how to roll the ice version of Shunko, though, you need to go ahead and buy the dev product, okay? If Ice Shunko isn't the first one that you roll, you're gonna have to spend Robux on it, or I believe that advanced Shunko rerolls are winnable through raids why is this guy trying to go brazy on me hold on bro All right, before I was interrupted by this guy right here, I'm gonna go ahead and show you the stats, okay? You wanna go 45 Hakata, and then you wanna go 20 speed. You want to make sure your skill boxes is Death Flare and Shori, okay? This is the best loadout for this build here. If you don't have Death Flare and Shori as your skill boxes, you need to blue pill and keep rolling your skill boxes till you get this combination, I'm sorry. 45 Hakata is here just so that your visor Sero actually does more. I realize there isn't a 45 Hakata skill, but just like how Flowing Petals was made, there might be a 45 Hakata skill in the future to be made. So 45 Hakata, 20 speed, 20 speed gives you Shunko. That's why you go 20 speed. Shout out to my people over at Gear Up Booster for making this possible. You can see my ping right now without Gear Up Booster. It's pretty mid, but after this match is over, I'm going to show you the power of Gear Up. All right, so the steps are pretty simple. Simply open up your Gear Up Booster, click on boost, let Gear Up do its magic. Once you're actually in to the boost, all you have to do is click play on your favorite game. So here we go. Finally into the gear up. All I have to do now is click play on type soul. And as you can see with the power of gear up, I was able to cut my ping down to 20. In a parry game like type soul, having my ping cut down from that much puts me at a major advantage. Gear up is going to make sure your ping will stay consistent and stable. So you are never going to be having random spikes in your gameplay. Even if your connection is already good, gear up will make sure you have little to no latency in the games you are playing. Gear up will also help people who struggle with bad network. Take me for example, I do not have the best internet in the world ever since i moved out to the countryside you can even use gear up to boost your console or mobile device click the link in the description right now down below to download gear up so you can go crazy on these strata strike hollow bite metamancers man okay so let me go over the sheik eye real quick and explain why it's super good with hakata okay it's because every move in this kit you have to be touching your opponent okay the z is super nice because it does guard break so dar go ahead and block real quick all right, I like to use this in the air because it's an instant guard break. Look at that. Now, when it comes back off cooldown again, there's going to be a different animation for the Z, which will still guard break, but it will also make your opponent crippled. So I'm going to hit the Z again. And then when you get the slash here, it takes a minute, probably like five seconds or so. It's going to cripple your opponent. You see that little butterfly on them? It's going to go ahead and cripple Dar right now, as you can see. And then he can't do anything. He can't dodge he can't flash up he can't do anything so it's super nice if you're able to land the z twice obviously you're only doing that with hakata realistically man the x is needle infliction i believe this goes through block dar go ahead and block it real quick yep it's a guard breaking as you can see it throws them out and then it will actually poison them this move is super nice to end your combos with in the air with hakata okay so imagine i do a full hakata combo and then i end them off with this and then you can pulse afterwards. If you do it fast enough, sometimes pulse will actually keep your air time so you can combo extend. But I haven't been able to pull that off today. I believe they might have patched it, but Needle Infliction is still good to end your combos with if you have no other moves. Silent Approach is the best thing in this moveset, bro. It's basically another story for you, okay? You press C, teleport to them, grab them. You can dash afterwards and freeze the ground, okay? And start your combos. Like, it, it's so free, right? And then let's say Dar parries this right here, right? I get parried here. Doesn't really matter because I have a sword coming at his face now. All right. I still have my Torah Reach. 
I just have so many options because this C right here is just so good, bro. You can also tour reach afterwards too if your tour reach is up. This build is super strong though, y'all. You want to abuse the fact that you have a ground crit. And then if I was to take Dart into the air, I still have an air crit that shares a separate cooldown. You just have too much in this kit, bro. Look at that. Like, you can just go brazy on them, boys. I'm going to go over the Bankai now. This is a super strong Bankai. First thing is first, all of your Shikai moves change. So, two-step. When you land it now, look at this. Knocks them back. Go straight into a tour reach. Super good. Needle infliction. I believe this has a bit more range now. I could be wrong. Let's see here. Oh, no. It's still a grab. Okay. Silent approach, though. If you use it, look at that. It's way faster now. But two-step is just super, super good now, bro. Look at the range on it. The range on two-step is way more. And then I'll just wait for needle infliction to come back off cooldown real quick. This does also change, too. Still going to be a grab, but look does more damage now and it knocks them afar so you're gonna have to like shory afterwards but the biggest upgrades with this bankai is that your silent approach is now faster as you can see and then your two-step has way more range so you can use it like right here see broken broken my boys the only thing that you lose out though is that you don't get the ice jungle crate anymore you get this sorry little dash thing that still puts you in the air but it's not as good as the ice cream, I'm going to be honest. Okay, now let's go ahead and use the ultimate here, the T move, all right? This move right here, you grab them, pummel them into the face, and it does like three bars, bro, depending on their defense. But it does a lot of damage. Dar, how much health are you at? He is at one bar and a half, so that did three and a half bars. That's actually crazy. And then launch, I believe this is still bugged. You're supposed to shoot at a rocket launcher? But, like, it does nothing right now. They got to fix that. I ain't gonna lie. The M1s in Bankai 2 lunge yourself to the opponent. Like, look at this. I ain't lying, bro. Look at this gravitational reach I got on this boy. You know? This is a super strong Bankai, though, bro. On me, it is. Look at this. About to go crazy on that boy, dog. Mm-hmm. You can just loop so much stuff with this Bankai, man. It's super good. Oh, and as you can see too, the X ragdolls, the Z ragdolls too. You literally can't do anything. But I just want to show off, even if you don't have the perfect timing in the world, look at this, bro. Look at how long this dude is ragdolled for. You have so much time to do something while he's knocked down. Same for your Z. Look at this. All that time, bro. You can't mess up with this Bankai. It's broken. About to be using gear up for the rest of this video, man. You know I got to get this low ping in all these matches, man. You know? Look at that. That low ping just made me hit that negation. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Look at that. Parry those too. It's that low ping, bro. I'm telling you. Hold up. Got you with these. Nice. Yep. Okay. Oh, shoot. I'm about to just absolute defense all this real quick, man, you know. Negation dose. Thank you. I like that. Ooh, good negation, my boy. Hit you with these. Nice. That was actually a good parry. What the heck? Okay. Hit him with these. Nice. I feel like he's going to try to, like, spam here. Instead of actually trying to parry these, so... Okay. Let me just activate Vision Mask here. He can't do much. Nice. Hit him with these. Freeze him here. Nice. Hit him with that. Yeah, he's about to die here, sadly. That was a good ice counter. I ain't gonna lie. Absolute defenses. There we go. And then I still have my C up. I'm gonna wait for him to come out here because he's trying to, like, cheese. Okay, there we go. Negation yourself? No. Okay. Freeze him. And he's dead. He has to die from this. There we go. GG's, my boy. All right, this guy's a Ronkar Hakata. So I got to be careful because he has Spine Run, as you can see. But since the Spine Run is off now, I can go Brazy. That has Hyper Arm. Are you serious? Okay, hold up. Dude was going crazy on me for a little minute. I ain't gonna lie. There we go. His spine run might be up, by the way. 
No, he has crazy blitz essence. He has a lot of counters to me. I ain't gonna lie. No, no, no. I messed up. Yikes. Okay. No, I keep messing up, boys. I'm low-key choking right now. Hold up. Let me stay locked, boys. There we go. He's gonna spine run here. I just know it. Let me go ahead and do this. There we go. Damn, he has hyper armor on top of hyper armor, boys. Okay, let me activate mask here. Go ahead and freeze him. Nice. He's gonna... I don't know why he's not... Oh my god, that's so broken, that hyper armor move. Like, our Gante having hyper armor, he has so many counters to me. Yikes. Can I absolute defense out of this? There we go. Okay. Yikes. Too many counters, man. Holy crap. Yeah, that was a tough match, bro. That was a super tough match. I'm low-key glad that he just wasn't using Spine Run to counter as much. I don't know why, so I definitely could have lost that one, though. I am fighting Rock Lee right now, as you can see. Okay. God damn. Hold up. Let me see if I can get him with these. There we go. No way. Those ice counter frames are crazy, gang. Okay. Good block. See if you block these, though. Okay. Hold up. This guy's low key a demon, isn't he? Yikes. Negation, all that. There we go. Grab him. Bro, my grab is not working today. It's such a sad life. Okay, I'm parrying that. I'm not parrying those. Like, I'm doing that every time to him. He just doesn't understand it, though. There we go. Shore him now. Yikes. Absolute. There we go. Pop mask here. Hit him with these. Hit him with these. Ooh, hold up. Bro's going brazy on me. Thank you. I'll take those. This guy's not bad. He is not bad at all. Yikes.
GG's to him. The wrong Arquito user. God damn. Oh my god. The cheese of death. Wait, he's a pocket of user too, though. He's a hybrid. I've been seeing a lot more hybrids, bro. I'm glad, man. Okay. What does he do off that, though? Not much, it looks like. Oh, wow. That was actually pretty cool. Yikes. Okay. Gonna absolute defense that. That's fine, because... I have this to the face here. There we go. Okay. Just gonna hyper armor through all that. That's fine to me. Shory. Yikes. I'm gonna get hit by all this, but that's fine. But I'm just gonna go ahead and mask here. There we go. I have my C up, so I'm just going to go ahead and, oh my god, I try to absolute defense all that, but it's whatever. There we go. Okay. That was actually good from him. Bro, that combo is actually disgusting. Gonna go and do this. Got his absolute defense out the way. I did not mean to do that. There we go. God damn it. The counter of doom. There we go. Bro, can this guy die already? Respectfully? That's so dumb, man. Come on, bro. Just die already, man. Thank you. Holy crap. People are so tanky now with the new items, bro. How much you want to bet this is a strata strike strata kid, bro? Every strata- oh, it's a bone guy, okay. I tried to negation that, but okay. He just used his speed essence already. That's actually good for us here. There we go. Okay, he's the type to spam M1. That's fine. Absolute defense through all this here. You wanna spam M1, my boy? I got you. Ooh, hold up. Hit you with these. Nice. God damn, bro. The spam M1 tech. Always works, my boy. God damn. Bone is so good, by the way. It's slept on. He's dodge variant, too. Okay. Absolute defense through all this here. Not getting hit by any of that. Good block. No way I got hit by that, right? Damn. I tried to negation that, but okay. 
There we go. That was good, Perry. I'll give it to him. Let me go ahead and activate mask here. Okay. Oh my god, I'm going crazy. Oh my god, bro. I'm so glad he did not pressure shift out of my combo there, bro. I clutched up towards the end. These motherfuckers are way too tanky right now in type soul, bro. They wanted to nerf damage across the boards, but then these new accessories just make you super tanky. I feel like type soul was in a good place before this update in terms of the time to kill somebody because right now, I think people are way too tanky. Speaking of tankiness, this guy has the new Yuha Ba cloak. He probably has everything else too, man. Like. You get like an extra 150 health, like 25% more defense if you're a wrong car. It's super crazy right now, boys. Super duper crazy. Okay. Good block. I'm dead, am I? I can't do anything off of that. Like, this guy's just dodging everything. He's parrying everything. This guy's nice, bro. I don't know how I'm going to get him at all. Maybe I get him with the... Uh, nope. He's probably regen variant too. That's a sad thing. Have a mask here. Pressure. Yep.
God damn it. This guy's just pairing everything. I need to like actually mix him here, but it's hard, man. It, it's super hard to mix this guy. He knows how to parry. Nice. Holy crap. GG's to this guy, man. I really had to use my brain there. Believe it or not, I had to use my brain on Hakata. This guy was actually, like, predicting me. I had to be unpredictable for a bit, but, yeah, that guy was good. Bro, this guy's trying to go crazy on me already, bro. Relax, buddy. Relax. I had to take a little water break. Oh, my God. First Kendall user of the day, actually. This is actually, like, a miracle. I'm so surprised. There we go. Why not? Why not, you know? Why not, you know? Yikes. That's a lot of damage. Oh crap. He is in an awkward position here. I ain't gonna lie. Okay. Absolute defense, all that. Thank you very much. Nope. Nope. Yikes. Hit him with these. There we go. There we go. Let's see if I can get him with the negation here. There we go. Alright. Iframe that. Ah, oh, crap. Gonna iframe that with my mask. Go ahead and counter that. There we go. Hit him with these. Hit him with these here. There we go. Hit him with that. How? How, Sway? How, Sway? There we go. And you're dead. Okay. Great way to end this video. That guy obviously didn't know how to fight Hakata, but I showed a little bit of everything today, right? I can show you what this build can do against people who don't know how to fight Hakata. It's also super good still against people who do know how to fight Hakata. At the end of the day, Hakata is very easy to counter if you know to block every story. You can also block my C move too. So it's up to you as a Hakata user to play the matchup even better and be more unpredictable because you will have some tough matchups. So you uh you can't turn your brain off every single time i'm not even gonna lie to you i'm out though y'all have a great day it is now or never fist of a guy like rot lee leg weight all can't stop me drunken fist at top speed 8 case flow get pop d